Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. This video is probably totally not necessary, but I just made a pie chart and I thought some pe most people will know how to do a real pie chart off of a, you know, if you have Excel, you can actually run a pie chart, but if you don't, and somebody's asked you to make a pie chart, just make a perfect circle, then take a two point line. And the reason I decided to make the video is that you don't want to use the duplicate key in this case. So double click on our line and move the rotation to the center. Always click off it and make sure it's there. And then I'm going to hit the plus key on my keyboard and hit 40%. Now, the reason I didn't do the duplicate key is if I control D and duplicated it and hit 40, then when I control D again, it adds another 40. We don't want that. We want to hit the plus key and then right here, just type in 65. Hit the plus key. Type in here plus 92. Well, I didn't, I didn't hit the plus key. Plus 92. The remaining balance is 63, and we can prove it by making the, well, back up. Hit the plus key and make the new one black, and then plus 163. And you can see it, it put it top dead center. So that is the 360 degrees of a pie chart. And then all you have to do is just move some numbers into your pie chart. And I could have done this. And if you didn't watch uh, part one of uh, this, it's pretty pretty neat how to make a, a pie chart kind of stand out. And even though these numbers aren't gonna be correct, because um, I didn't do a percentage, you could put your percentage in there. And actually you could add a white line to make it a little bit uh, more pronounced looking of a pie. Anyway, hope that helped just a little bit. Thank you for watching.